welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that find the regression coefficients dyx and dxy for the following data. Also find the correlation coefficient. And in this data, it is given n is equal to 5, summation x is equal to 15, summation x squared is equal to 55, summation y is equal to 25, Summation y squared is equal to 151 and summation xy is equal to 88. Now before starting the solution of this question, we should do some results. And that are the regression coefficient of y on x, that is dyx is given by the formula. Summation xy minus summation x into summation y over n whole upon summation x square minus summation x whole square by n. And secondly, the regression coefficient of x and y, that is, dxy is given by the formula summation xy minus summation x into summation y over n whole upon summation y square minus summation y whole square by n. And next, r square is equal to byx into dxy where r is the correlation coefficient. And the value of r varies from minus 1 to 1. Now these results will work out as a key idea. So solving out this question. And now we will start with the solution. Now in the question using this data we have to find the regression coefficients and also the correlation coefficient. So given n is equal to 5, summation x is equal to 15, summation x squared is equal to 55, summation y is equal to 25, summation y square is equal to 151, and summation xy is equal to 88. Now using these results, which are given in the key idea, now the regression coefficient of y on x is byx and byx is given by the formula summation xy minus summation x into summation y over n whole upon summation x square minus summation x whole square by n. Now summation x is 15 Summation y is 25, summation x square is 55, and summation x y is 88, and n is 5. So using all these values here, this is equal to 88 minus 15 into 25 over 5, whole upon 55 minus 15 square by 5. Further, this is equal to 440 minus 375 whole upon 5 whole upon 275 minus 225 whole upon 5. On solving, this is equal to now 440 minus 375 is 65 over 5 into 5 over 275 minus 225 is 50, which is further equal to 65 by 50, and on solving it will give 1.3. Therefore, dyx is equal to 1.3. Now, the regression coefficient of x on 
y is dxy and dxy is given by the formula summation xy minus summation x into summation y by m whole upon summation y square minus summation y whole square by m. Now m is 5, summation x is 15. Summation y is 25, summation y square is 151, and summation xy is 88. Now putting all these values here, this is equal to 88 minus 15 into 25 by 5, whole upon 159 minus 25 square by 5. Further, this is equal to 450 minus 375 whole upon 5 whole upon 755 minus 625 whole upon 5 which is further equal to now 430 minus 375 is 65 over 5 into 5 over 755 minus 625 is 130 which is further equal to 65 by 130, which in solving will give 0 0.5. Therefore, dxy is equal to 0 0.5. Now, r square is equal to byx into dxy. Now, byx is 1.3 and dxy is 0 0.5. So putting these values here, this implies R square is equal to 1.3 into 0 0.5, which further gives R square is equal to 0 0.65, which implies R is equal to plus minus 0 0.8062. Now, dyx and dxy being both positive, therefore R is also positive. Now the value of R depends on the value of BYX and BXY, that is, if BXY and BYX both are positive, then R is also positive. And if dyx and dxy both are negative, then r is also negative. Therefore, considering the positive sign here, r is equal to 0 0.8062. Hence, the regression coefficient dyx is equal to 1.3. The regression coefficient dxy is equal to 0 0.5. And the correlation coefficient R is equal to 0 0.8062. So this is the solution of the given question and that's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.